Hey y'all, I'm Ashlyn. I'm Emily. And I'm Marla. And we want you to mansplain baseball elsewhere. Yay! Um, I am toasting with a truly berry punch. Because the new berry, or the new, I've already had one of these. The new punch flavors are out. They came out on the 10th. So find them. It was like happy birthday to me a day early. Yeah. Um, I promise y'all I'll stop talking about my birthday, but in June. Anyway, so I'm toasting to National Mimosa Day. Though I had no mimosas day, I just had truly punches. And this is the fourth flavor I'm trying. So, oh, it tastes like great. Yeah, it's like grape co. I like it. Yeah. This it's my like favorite. Dangerous. Like, it's, it's like a less dangerous. sweet grape co to me. Yeah. yeah. It works. It's good. I'm a, I so I the fruit punch. I mean, tastes just like fruit punch. Tropical is good. Uh, the citrus I liked. Ashlyn didn't like because she doesn't it. like Sprite. Yeah, it tastes like Sprite to me. Anyway, it tastes like Sprite to me, and I hate all lemon lime soda things. Like I hate Sprite. I hate Seven Up. You I hate Mountain like, Dew. It doesn't taste like that. I hate them all. If you're like drinking bourbon and need an extra kick, mix it with that citrus punch. It'd be yeah. Delicious. Like I might try that. I'll only be around people you trust when you do that. So because yeah. like it says five percent, but that five percent can add up real quick. Mm-hmm. Um. But yes, new. I found mine at Publix. Ashlyn got hers at the gas station. Yes. Here, also, I learned something. I'm sure lots of websites have this, but I went because I knew the Truly Punches were coming out on the 10th. Uh-huh. And I also knew that I live in the middle of fucking nowhere and it's really hard to find things. So I was trying to not have to drive all over the world. So you can go to the Truly website and type in your zip code and pick out whichever one, like, you can pick yeah. out fruit punch, fruit punch, and it tells you like where around you has it. Now there is the chance that you'll get there and it'll be sold out because that's what happened to David when he went so to get them for me. A little map, like, but I gave him four places. options, and one of the places had it. So there's that. But yeah, so you can do that with because I also did the same thing with the citrus ones, and there's a grocery store that I don't normally go to that has the citrus ones that I sent David to that grocery store today. So he can get me some Also, let's toast to husbands who go four different places to find you truly. Yeah, especially when you only drink a couple. And then he's like, really? I guess he was wanting me to get, like, blackout drunk or something. But didn't <laughs> he had plans know. last night, actually. He, he must have had plans. Because he was like, I drove all over the world, and you're going to drink two? I was like, I'll drink some more tomorrow. Thank you. Love you. Um, I'm pro. I like the fruit punch too, but honestly, I think berry is my favorite, which is interesting because I don't love the berry, the regular berry. Oh, trees. the norm, like the normal truly berries are like okay, but that's not yeah. the pack I pick up. Like, right? Like, I always okay, but but now yeah. I go. Yeah, like I go for the citrus or the tropical. So I'm probably going like berry, and then the tropical one. And then the fruit punch. And then the citrus will honestly probably just sit in my refrigerator until someone comes over who likes Sprite. That's not me. Send it to me. I can do that because <laughs> I'm not going to drink them. Shout out to Truly We Love You. I just don't like Sprite. It's not you. It's me. Yes. Um, also, so I'm tr- t- I'm trusting. Mm. We might as well call it trusting. <laughs> really? <laughs> but if we do have Truly's every week. I am toasting with a truly fruit punch, which is delicious. And I am toasting to, because I'm an unbiased podcaster, Corey Seager having a quick and speedy recovery because he fractured his hand yesterday. And I hope he gets better soon. Tell us about Dustin May while we're here. And then we'll circle back tomorrow. Okay, so Dustin had his surgery. Actually, I'm a little... Dustin's surgery was scheduled for the 11th, your birthday. We talked about that last week. Mm -hmm. Um, But nothing, nothing from anyone, him, beat reporters, the Dodgers, nothing was posted until the 12th. So I don't know if maybe they just waited a day. I guess that wouldn't be that weird. Or if his surgery ended up getting pushed today. Either way, not that weird. But the surgery was successful. And he's hanging out. He's out for the year. He will be out for 
most of hot ass fiance to plan a wedding to nurse him that. back to health. Yeah, he's out for the whole year, obviously, and he'll be out for the majority, or I say the majority part of next year. I'm sure he'll be back for like the second half. He'll be trying to beat the Braves in the playoffs. Yeah, in my week. mind, he's coming back after the po- the postseason, after the All Star break next year. I don't know if that's accurate. It may be later. It may be sooner. I don't fucking know. I've never had Tommy John surgery before, but I feel like that's a decent thought in my head. And I feel like he's going to come back and throw like 108 miles an hour. So we'll see. Because he's going to have a fake like, I was about to say, it'll be like the Winter Soldier. Like somebody braving him probably got put in there. Or yeah, something. like he has like an extra brand new tendon. Like, nah, he's going to throw 108. If he so goes to Honda for a vacation this winter, uh, watch out. So. Mm-hmm. Basically, so what are you toasting to with your normal ass truly? I'm so sorry. I'm you have a sorry. Like, okay, listen, I did the, the search on the map thing too. Yeah. And supposedly we have like a beer distributor. I don't know if those are like a nationwide thing. Pennsylvania no, is Pennsylvania liquor. is really weird. Yeah. With their- we have like certain stores that we go to get like grocery stores just a couple of years ago. We're starting, we're allowed to start selling beer and wine. So, but there are still like, you can't get like huge packs at grocery stores. So a beer distributor has like the bigger packs where you can get like 24 packs and such. Anyway, supposedly we have one in our town. Supposedly they have the punch there and at a grocery store down the road from us. But, and I planned to get up this morning and go and do it. But instead I got up but this morning and had alcohol in the morning. So, so that's a plus. I did. Yeah, can't we can't do that. Yeah. I was about to say Sunday yeah. morning, we can't buy liquor or alcohol at all here. Good luck. Yeah, our, our, it was, uh, are, are they called Blue Laws down there? It was called Blue mm-hmm. Laws for us. They just got taken off the books a few years ago, maybe like five, six years ago. So, um, but yeah, we can buy alcohol on Sundays now. But I think they didn't open till like 10. Um, so I was going to get up and go and get some. Uh, and then I installed an air conditioner and then didn't have time. Pens started at noon. Wait, you and installed I was a whole ass air conditioner? Yeah, we had to get it in today. Let's toast to Marla. Right? <laughs> Cheers. Um, Yes, I'm a handy woman. Kind of. Uh, nothing broke, at least. So there's that. There you go. Um, so what are you what toasting, am I toasting to? to? I think I'm going to You're toast. You're still? <laughs> yeah. That a little bit. But also, <laughs> I'm going to toast to hopefully I have good luck this week because I've got an ophthalmologist appointment tomorrow to get contacts. So Ooh, hopefully yay. they tell me that I, I think I have astigmatism I and I've heard that they're so hard to get. If you have contact or like contacts are harder, but they're getting better. Yeah, they they're get, a lot they're better now. Better. Yes. So I'm hoping for good luck. I'm going to toast to my eye doctor uh, and that they will do a good job tomorrow. 